Hey everybody, it's me Katie and I'm back with a really exciting haul, I think anyway. Um, Matt came out with a crazy big collection. It's called the Mac Me Over collection, kind of like Make Me Over, but they used Mac, M-E-C. And it's like a 51 piece collection or something like that. Um, so there was definitely a lot to choose from. So I'm excited to show you guys what I got from that. I did go a little a bit overboard, but um, who really cares, right? So let's get into it. I guess I will start with, I don't know, what's really, okay. I did get three lip glasses, and I know some, like, some people say, oh, they're so sticky, why bother with them, blah, blah, blah. I like them, and honestly, I couldn't resist some of these um, shades. So let's see. I got Illicit, which is like a light peach like a nice nude color definitely like light, light peachy nude that's pretty and then um, curvaceous which um, is a little bit like a purpley plum but I like that and I was looking at um, I was going to temptalia.com to see swatches and stuff um, so I figured it's not like a super purple that, you know, it's like a nice soft, I'm slowly getting into like plums and purples. I have a MAC lip gloss, I forgot the name of it, but it's like a light purple. And I also have one from Cora's, which is like a purpley pink, which I really like. So slowly I'm getting into, you know, these purple colors. And then I got Social Light, which is an awesome like, I like light cranberry, but it has like a weird like iridescent heat like I don't know that the gold but this was so pretty when Tamtalia swat on her site when she swatched it and it was just freaking I was like in love I think this one's gonna be like a really popular color so I'm really I haven't tried this yet but oh so pretty those are the three lip glasses there was one other one that I think I want to get but I'm not sure it's like these were all from the I forget the name but it was more of like the nude collection there's three different parts but these were all in the same section. And there's another a fourth lip gloss, which I think I want to get, which is darker. Um, a little bit more of like a plummy cranberry, if I remember. But it looks so pretty, so I may still get that. I don't know. I did get a lot from that first collection, more of like the, new, the naturals. Um, like, for example, um, I got four of the eyeshadows from, I wish I remembered the names. But it was that first, it was more of like the natural the first part of the whole thing. This one's in Creamy Bisque. I really like this color. It's a great, great highlight. And um, it's like a white pearl, which is really pretty. I've been using this a couple times. It's so, so nice. And then this one, um, Moleskin, which they're saying it could be just like um, Urban Decay Shadow, I believe it's called Naked, um, which it does it is similar, but I think naked like a little bit darker. Um, but I put this on all over my lid the other day. It was so pretty. Just like a light brown. Gorgeous. But now I'm going to have to get like a MAC palette and depot all these and put them all together. This is also a really nice color. It's called um, Carbonized. It's a dark brown. with like little kind of like gold reflex in it. I don't know if you're able to see, but there we go. It's just so pretty. And this is a, it's a Velux Pearl. Wait, can you see that? It's just the nicest like brown with a sheen. Oh, what were the other ones? I should have, let's see. Creamy Bisque. Why am I even putting these back in the boxes? It's like some pointless. Creamy Bisque is um, a frost. And then um, Moleskin is a matte. But that you can probably tell. Um, and then I got this color, um, Mythical. It's really nice, like cranberry. Kind of a cranberry brown, but also has like gold reflex. It is also a deluxe pearl. 
and in this collect they also had two other eyeshadows they had satin taupe which i already have and then they had like this yellow mustardy color i forget what it was called but that was like a no for me i would never use it but um so those are the eyeshadows and then um i did get one of the eye coals in teddy it's just a really nice brown the only other eye liner i have for mac is the feline which is like an awesome black but this is the uh nice brown but um i'm so in love with brown eyeliners i used to be like all about black a few years ago but now i'm just i love brown eyeliners and then i did get um three of the shadow sticks I've never tried the MAC Shadow Stick, so when I saw that they came out with some more, because I know they got rid of them, so I really, really wanted to try them now that they were back, because I love Shadow Sticks. I love the Mally Shadow Sticks. I know, um, I also like, you know, like the NYX Pencil Shade Sticks, and then the, what are the other ones? I think I have, like, two from Avon, which are really good, but this one... It's called um, Heirloom. Just is like the light purple. Which I thought would be so pretty. What's that? Like a purpley. This is the color on the bottom. But so that's gorgeous. And then I got. Um, Um, butter nutty which is this would be like a really nice like all over the lid like a base it's like, like a light nude this is that color and then oh it's so pretty this would be like a great um there it is like inner corner or under the brow as like a highlight so pretty and I got one that's a little bit darker and it is um street cool i think they had like a light green one and i think maybe another one but that's the color but i just didn't these three caught my eye almost look like it's a, a satin taupe but in a cream stick i think it's a little bit more of like a purple in there that's it right there it's really pretty this would be great crease color or like above the water line and then I got one of the um, cream bases in seashell. Now this one could also be really good as just like a bronzer because it's kind of dark. But um, I thought this would be really pretty either like as a base or just using it as like a contour maybe or just like on the cheekbones or like the you know for contouring so we'll play around with that see how it is but I just thought it was really it's kind of like a unique color then I got a blush which I love it's um, stunner and they described it as like a coral but it's more of like a light more like pinky than it is a coral but it's just so pretty I've been wearing this like almost every day I don't know if you can see the middle not really but oh my god it is really nice. I'm glad I got this. And then the last couple items are the fluid lines. Fluid liners? Fluid, fluid lines? The gels. And um, I got three. There were four. But three of them were really like, get me, get me. So, And I really like there. I have um, Dip Down, which is brown, which I use almost every day. But this one is Dark Envy, and it is the green. These are just so pretty. Their fluid liners are really good. These and like Bobbi Brown I love. And then um, Dark Di Dark Diversion. Just a really nice purple. Browns and purples are like my favorite. To wear like eyeliner wise really like browns and purples and the last one I got was the blue one which is called midnight blues it's really pretty oh it's such a nice dark blue I love it almost no no you can definitely tell that's blue looks a little black on the screen but 
So yeah, that's everything I got from the Mac Me Over collection. Um, I know it's a lot, but um, I've been using, I've already used a lot of these products and oh my god, they're so fun. I'm really excited to get into the shadow sticks and um, trying out more of those lip glosses. So that was cool. And then um, I actually bought the shadow sticks on, um, my foot just fell asleep. Oh, such a weird feeling. Um, I bought those on Nordstrom. Dot com and I also bought um, a NARS lipstick because I've been wanting this forever. It's the Pago Pago, Pago Pago, however you say that lipstick. And um, I am wearing it now. It's just a really nice, it is sheer. But sheer, like light pinky brown nude. It's just so pretty. gorgeous gorgeous color so I definitely got that and since I ordered those shade sticks in this online I got a little packet of um, samples mostly like perfume so I got um, the flora by Gucci to try and the twirl from Kate Spade I think I already have a couple of these but it smells good and then I got the Viva La Juice Oh, where did it fill out? The Viva La Juicy, which I love, love, love this. So I'm glad I got another sample. And soon I'm going to buy like a full bottle of it because I love it. And then also um, the Miracle Worker, the, the eye cream from Philosophy. And then Kate Somerville Skin Health Experts, a Cytocell Dermal Energizing Treatment. I really don't know what this is. Apply a thin layer to cleanse face and neck. Can be used alone or layered over a treatment serum and or under a moisturizer. So you can put this on and then like a moisturizer. So I don't really know if it's like a, I don't think it's like a primer. It's just like a face treatment that you can put on before your moisturizer. Interesting. And then um, MAC also had more Sheen Supreme lipsticks come out. So I, I ended up getting two of those, which I'm really lucky, like really lucky, really liking. Um, so I got one in Blossom Couture, which is this really nice, like perfect pink. It's just I love it. It's so pretty. Wore it the other day and gorgeous. So there it is, right there. So pretty. I love it. These are really good. They're really smooth. They last maybe about like three to four hours. And then they'll really start to fade. Then this I got in Supreme Style. Which I was wearing this morning, but then when I came home and saw the package and I saw the NARS, I put that on. This is just a nice like nude. Thinking nude. Right there on the bottom. But that's also really, really pretty. So yeah, these two were my favorite. Um so Blossom Couture and Supreme Style. These are really great, great lipsticks. Um, I suggest, you know, if you're looking for a new lipstick or something, go try these uh, Sheen Supremes out because they're awesome. Um, but yeah, that's it. That's my MAC haul. Hope you liked it. I know it's a lot of stuff. If you want reviews on anything, please leave a comment below and let me know. Have a great day. Bye.